Again, thank you so much for joining us here on Idaho Today. Teachers, you know what though? They're not just in the classroom. They're also by your bedside, like the nurturing education and support provided by a midwife. Midwives are your partners in health care. And when most people hear the term midwife, they think of individuals that only deliver babies in patients' homes. But St. Alphonsus midwives provide excellent customized care alongside physicians in the office, as well as surgical assistants in the hospital. This physical and emotional care goes hand in hand, resulting in a confident birthing experience. Francis, Rebecca, it's so great to have you both here. And I would love to know about a midwife. What's the difference between a midwife and a doula and an MD? Thank you so much for having us. So a certified nurse midwife is a healthcare professional that practices in a variety of settings. We specifically practice in the hospital and clinic setting. Um, they, the nurse midwife is master's or doctorate degree prepared. And we practice a myriad of different modalities to help to make a woman feel like this part of her life is normalized. We do both medicine and holistic remedies to help to bring a holistic approach to the practice. And in recent years, we've become quite a bit more popular as women and families are looking for more low intervention in their pregnancies and also more of a uh, organized birth plan and birth process. Like that organized birth plan and birth process. And you'd mentioned you practice in the hospital. Do you deliver babies anywhere else or just in the hospital setting? So we just deliver babies in the hospital setting uh, as far as our practice with St. Alphonsus. And uh, we also see patients in the office for general wellness, pap smears, birth control, um, different types of care that women might need over the lifespan. So you address multiple parts of women's wellness then, yeah. even outside of pregnancy. We do. Yes, so this is fantastic. And I know too that this is something that you both carry very close to your heart, not only when you're taking care of others, but you take care of each other. We do. Yes, because Frances, you helped her birth a baby, right? I did. She did, my first. Your very first. Yes. See, this is beautiful. Yes. And I think this is a type of connectivity and care that a lot of women who are expecting a child really look for, right? Because this is such an intimate and important and beautiful moment in a woman's life. Right. Absolutely. So you had also asked what was the difference between a nurse midwife yes. and then let's say a doula. Mm -hmm. So doulas typically tend to be more female uh -huh. and uh, their goal and their role is to provide comfort, reassurance, and support for a woman and her family during the pregnancy, birth, and postpartum periods. They take a variety of courses and they sit for a certification exam, mm -hmm. but their goal is not to provide medical advice. They should okay. just be providing support, reassurance, and support for those families, which we know is so desperately needed during this very vulnerable time for women. Absolutely, and then on that note, compare that then to an MD. Well, uh, one other thing with doulas is they help to provide support for the non-pharmaceutical pain remedies for someone that might want a non-medicated birth. Okay, okay, that's great to understand. And then, so, so that was a doula versus a midwife. Now, what about a midwife versus an MD? So I think MDs need very little introduction. They are board certified in our world. They are specialized in obstetrics and gynecology. They uh, manage a variety of different complex situations, both gynecological and obstetrics. Mm -hmm. They rarely require extra specialization within their specialty. They do surgeries, they do most cases independently, and they have a variety of years of experience for medical training. Right. And they, and they uh, approach care from a different standpoint. Like they may be looking for more of a medicalized approach in terms of what do the different sources say as far as evidence-based care. And we also incorporate that but we incorporate the parts of a woman's emotional health, mm -hmm. her physical health, and her uh, desires for customization in terms of how she may visualize her birth. Mm -hmm. it, it's, it's a complete package here. And then you, you kind of mentioned some of those benefits of having a midwife, right? So it's kind of the happy in-between, if you will, of, uh, of a doula and then also an MD, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like we do have a very customizable approach. Yeah. While we are all very different and have different niches, so to speak, I always tell our families that no matter who is there to care for you when your birth happens, they will provide you with the utmost care and uh, just overall comfort that's required to get you through that process. 
great. And if somebody watching is interested in looking into the midwife program at St. Alphonsus, because I understand too, there are eight midwives at St. Al's. Um, what makes your program different than others? Mm. That's a good question. Well, we actually like each other. <laughs> we uh, have uh, a certain continuity of care that is provided. And even though we all may approach things differently, our goal is excellence. And so because of that, we can trust each other to take over for a patient that may be our patient and maybe um, they're there on the day when one of our partners is on call and we can have complete confidence that the excellence and care will continue. So we work very well together. We also work with different specialties. So not only do you have the nurse midwife that's available to you, we also have our OBGYN physician team that we work closely with. We work closely with maternal fetal medicine if there's any unforeseen complications that maybe we hadn't prepared for. And we collaborate well, so you might never see a physician during your pregnancy, but we know that if needed, we're always able to act very quickly and provide patients with a very safe experience. Wonderful, and where can women go to learn more? Women can go to stalfonsis.org slash midwife.